Hello dear friends and hearty greetings from Boca Raton Beach in South Florida. God has given us once again a most beautiful day with the gentle breezes that keep us from getting sweaty and yet the warmth of the sun and the beauty that surrounds us from top to bottom are very significant indeed. Daily those of us who watch television inevitably face a variety of bombardments with commercials. And one that I have been noticing with great frequency here in South Florida, I don't know whether it's nationwide or limited only to this region, has someone alluding to something very interesting and that's why I'm using that to share something with you. And the idea is simply that when life sends you a wake-up call, pay attention to it. Let me repeat. When life sends you a wake-up call, pay attention to it and how significant it is. And yet you and I know very well that throughout our entire lives, we find many wake-up calls that life continues sending to us and yet we pay no attention whatsoever and therefore we do not receive the message which would be in most cases beneficial to us and of course in my own mind i have one wake-up call that unfortunately large numbers of persons decide to pay no attention at all and that is the wake-up call concerning our spiritual life concerning our relationship to our Creator Almighty God and yet this is the most important of all because someday according to the scriptures we shall appear face to face before him and we have to give account of so many things that we have done or left undone things that we did that we should not have done and things that we refrain from doing which was an obligation and a duty for us to fulfill so in bringing this to your attention i simply want to say don't bypass the continual message that comes to you by various means from television through the radio in local congregations and sometimes through the warnings, the gentle warnings of a family member or a close friend or someone who wants you to understand the necessity of having your life benefit from the most that you can benefit. So pay attention to these things and respond with a sense of urgency because we never know what the next moment, the next hour, and even the next day would bring to us of good or of bad. But God is patient and willing to give you far more than you can ever imagine for your own good, for your benefit, not only for this life, but most specially what He offers you for the life that is to come. So think about it. Think earnestly. Think diligently. And be sure that your response accompanies this question and this appeal that is left for you. Bye-bye.